All right, I'm back. I had to run downtown to get the stuff to sleeve the drag link and the tie rod link. So we'll get turned around here. We'll get you all set up for you to watch me cut, grind, and weld. So my pipe here is 12 inches. I'm gonna mark it. So I put it halfway in. Now what I'm going to end up doing is cutting slots in this so I can come back and weld the pipe inside as long as welding it around here and then slide the other tube on and then weld the two tubes together. And this one will get cut. Cut. So let me cut my slices in it. I think we'll have to cut it a little wider. Let me swap out blades. All right, I got my pipe sleeve.
Let it cool down. So hopefully I've minimized the warping. Where there it is, a little grinding and paint makes me the welder I ain't, but she's solid. There's my slot welds, plug welds, whatever you call them. And what does she measure out to? Final is 52 and a half center to center. Let's put it in. You gotta be careful, she's still warm. There she is. She needs a little bit of adjustment. Okay, as you can see, way better angles. It's a straight shot from the pitman arm to the knuckle. And it follows the lower tie rod pretty close. It's a little bit further aft on the pitman arm. I don't know if I can find a shorter one or possibly heat that one and bend it to where it'll pull the drag link actually forward a little bit. But right now this is way better than trying to use the Astro box with a drop pitman arm or the Astro pitman arm. But this is way better. <laughs> we